the rebels hide among the villagers, inviting the Roman backlash to fall upon the most vulnerable. Many villagers are slaughtered in the fight. You're saying he does this knowingly? This tactic creates martyrs for the cause, and families eager to take vengeance upon the Romans. This plan was to cause a slaughter, to recruit more rebels. He's done this again and again. He is building a rebellion at a terrible price. He is a friend. Recall that Cleopatra was more than a friend. Yet I trusted her too well. You. Yeah. I am astonished by Gamila. I am astonished by Gamilat's actions. Is he leading the rebellion for personal power? I don't think so. I believe he wants the rebellion to succeed so badly that he is blind to the cost. He genuinely sees the villagers as martyrs. He does not consider that they had no choice. And the tactic has been successful. He will certainly use it when the Romans send another general. Let's keep moving. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Tell me of your life in Rome. It's a marvelous place, full of intrigue, deceit, and corruption. <laughs> the perfect city for a hidden one. <laughs> I expected you to talk about the wine. The wine is very good. You should come visit sometime. We'll have a take. He will be surrounded by his rebels. Ah, they see him as a god. We cannot... Oh, going to hurt him, sir. Ah, well. You are safe. Awful young, aren't you? Come here, play soldier, have a laugh. Neb, where is your... I have no reason to laugh. Sure, it is all very serious. Why are you here then? Whoa. Yeah. The great hope of the Nabataeans. I am about to disappoint them all. What is this about? You have been provoking massacres. Many innocent villagers have died. I have exposed the vile cruelty of the Romans. Those martyrs have inspired countless warriors to continue the fight. Martyrs? What are the lives of a few villagers in light of freedom for all? The lives of a few villagers? They had no choice in the matter. Bayek, don't be absurd. We fight on the same side. No. Here, we simply fight. So be it. You will be the ultimate martyr. Your blows will glance off this shield. You 
have become a torch for the cause! You are a fool to attack the leader of the rebellion! This gives me no pleasure! Once and for all! Turn, Dye! Let your accusations turn to ashes! Turn, Dye! Let your accusations turn to ashes! You have become a torch for the cause! Come back here, coward! You fight well, Hidden One, but my shield is the strongest in all the Sinai! Burn, Bayek! Let your accusations turn to ashes! It's over, Bayek! I have the high ground! There is freedom, and there is the life of innocence. Both must be balanced on this scale. It is now my heart that will lie upon the scale of Anubis. Your heart beat too strongly in favor of its cause. The innocent must always be protected. My ardor shone like sun in my eyes. Blinding me. You have done right by me. I accept this death. From this day, no hidden one will raise a sword against an innocent. So it shall be written. May you find peace in the Duat. And may the hidden ones last until the end of time. The greatest of leaders, Gamilat, is now dead. And his story lives on in the warriors of the Sinai. He could kill a million tyrants with one breath. A divine arrow. The great Gamilat is no longer. Should we kill their dreams? 
Let them have their heroes. For now, the hidden ones are forgotten. This is to our favor. Gamelat's death serves a higher cause. No more senseless martyrs. We done good. Our tenets need to be passed on to those who have taken our oath, so they have a true creed to study. The Hidden Ones will pass on to Petra and towards Judea, and forever. The creed must live beyond anyone. No one shall be bigger than the greater group. When I return to Rome, I will not speak of heroes. I will speak of discipline and perseverance. Amunet is a mentor to this brotherhood. Our will never rests. And our blades shall never tire. Done good. <laughs> <laughs>